fall is harvest time and for our finances, it's the perfect season to review this year's efforts, take stock and prepare our green for a fruitful new year. Schools First Federal Credit Union is here to help us reap the financial rewards of this year and plant the seeds for 2025. Let's welcome Nathan Calhoun, Calvine Point Branch Manager for Schools First Federal Credit Union. Hey, Nathan. Uh, good morning. Thank good you. morning. Okay, so again, it's crazy that it's almost the end of the year. Yeah. <laughs> We're already talking about it, but it's a good time to review and maybe plan for 2025. So as we approach the end of the year, Nathan, why is it so important to take stock of our financial crops and make sure we're ready for the next season. Yeah, you know, year-end financial planning is essential because it gives you a moment to, you know, as you mentioned, take stock of your financial health, make any year-end financial moves before it's too late, mm -hmm. uh, and essentially just set yourself up for success in the coming new year. Um, you can kind of think about it as a financial checkup. Mm -hmm. By reviewing your finances now, you can make more informed decisions about where your finances are going, set better goals, and put in a plan of action to execute those goals. I like it, financial checkup, it sounds less scary. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so what areas should we focus on to ensure we're getting the most out of the year and making wise choices for the months ahead? You know, one of the first things I'd look at is your retirement contributions. A lot of folks out there, their employer will offer a match of their contributions up to a certain amount but not everybody is maximizing that. So I would set a goal to look at making sure that you're maximizing that because if not, you're leaving money on the table. Mm. Next thing I'd look at would be your taxes. Uh, there's a chance that you might be able to relieve some tax burden through some sort of activities like charitable contributions or maybe once mm. again, making contributions, additional contributions towards a uh, tax advantaged account. Mm -hmm. uh, and lastly, I do a review of your insurance. You know, as life goes on, your needs change, they evolve and so might your insurance needs. Make sure your policy is still having the adequate coverage needed mm -hmm. for your current situation. That's a good point to make. I haven't checked my insurance since I signed up for it three years ago. So yeah, yeah it's kind of important yeah. to make sure it's, it's matching your needs. Yeah. When it comes to setting financial goals for the new year, what are some practical steps we can all take now to ensure we're planting strong foundations for growth? Setting goals is important. I think there's a couple steps you can do when you're setting goals to get more out of them. Um, you know, start with making a very specific goal. Instead of saying, next year I want to save more money, say, I want to save $300 per year. It's specific. Mm -hmm. uh, make sure your goal is measurable. You know, something to be able to track. You can actually see it happening. It'll keep you on track throughout the year. Make sure your goals are achievable too. You know, they should be challenging goals, but they should be realistic. Yeah. Um, go ahead and make sure they're relevant for whatever your plans are right now, whatever you're going through in life, mm -hmm. and make sure there's a time frame that you're gonna achieve your goal by. Yeah, so then you can achieve it by, fingers Absolutely. crossed. <laughs> Absolutely. Are there any final tips for our viewers as they prepare for the new year, Nathan? Yeah, you know, it's a great time of year to start gathering all your financial documents for the tax season that's yeah. coming up. Um, if you do want help with doing a financial checkup, make an appointment with either a credit union representative or a financial advisor. Uh, if you haven't already done so, we always say once a year, check your credit report to make sure everything's accurate. Mm -hmm. um, and lastly, I would just say that uh, if you have any changes in your income or expenses, update your budget. Mm -hmm. Lastly, I would just remind everybody that financial success often enough comes through making a plan and sticking to it. Mm -hmm. If you ever need assistance, Schools First is uh, here to help you. I like it. You don't have to go through it alone. Schools yeah. First is here to help. Nathan, always a pleasure having you on the show. Thank you. All right, to our viewers, you can visit one of the many Schools First Federal Credit Union branch locations as seen on the screen right there. And you can find out more online by going to schoolsfirstfcu.org.